The one hour workday? Yeah, sounds kind of scammy, especially if you're 50 and over. You're like, what is this crap? There's no way you could build a one person business working one hour a day. And I'm here to tell you, it actually is possible, but I want to break down what works, what doesn't work, and some big challenges and some roadblocks that you want to avoid. So I've been building one person businesses since the late 90s. I started when I was a uh, gym teacher in the South Bronx and I was teaching online strength and conditioning and I was kind of really early in the game. I was lucky, I got, er I got in early, but I learned how to do this and build these businesses without building big teams. So I'd build my business during lunch breaks, in the morning, at night, whenever I could. And it really comes down to being super <laughs> methodical and create a system of what you have to do and what you have to focus on. So here's what you don't wanna do. What you don't wanna do is start the day, turn on your phone, go onto social media, go onto Facebook or X and get triggered. Oh my God, politics and this and, and like getting in these debates. That's not really a good use of your time because it just, it just eats away at your day. So I've been talking about my system that I've really kind of refined and perfected over decades and it's called GWB and it's just broken down to three things, grow, write, and bank. And if you, now, and I have another video and I'll leave it below and I broke this down in detail talking about it, it, in a perfect world, it's like a three hour day, right? And you spend the first hour on your growth strategies and that's traffic. So for me right now, it's YouTube. It used to be Facebook ads. I'm going to start running ads again, but for now I'm just kind of playing and doing YouTube. So whatever your growth strategy is, and it might be LinkedIn, it might be Facebook, it might be writing other articles, it might be a podcast, it could be paid YouTube ads, whatever it is, that's the first third of your day. The first, so in a three hour day, it's the first hour. The second is writing and that's email, that's building connections and trust and community. And it could, it's mostly from, because it's writing email because that's where like 90% of your income is gonna come, is from email. It's not from social media. It's getting social media onto your list and then writing. Um, and it could be building your community. So if you have a group, going in there and communicating and doing trainings and things like that. And the third part is, is B, which is bank, which is how are you going to make money? And that's where you create products and programs and do you want to do coaching? Do you want to have a membership site? You could work on the website for it. What's called a sales letter or sales page or sales copy. Um, what does that look like in the, in the hardcore marketing world? We call these things funnels as well. There's a lot of things that we can get into the weeds with that. But just know that that third of your time is going to be on there. So great. This is a three hour day. Well, what about this one hour day, Ryan? What about this one hour day you promised in the video in the title? This is clickbait. When I go away, so when, when my wife and I take our four kids on vacation, I say to her, all I need is one hour in the morning. Just give me one hour. So I'm, I'm an early riser. Maybe you're like me and you like to get up early. Um, I don't set the alarm, but I'm usually up at like six o'clock anyway, sometimes 5.30. And what I do when I'm on vacation is I get dressed, I shower. Well, actually, I usually do a little quick workout. Then I go downstairs and Wherever we are in, the, in the, the hotel, the resort, I go to the lobby and every hotel or resort's gonna have a lobby. They're going to have free coffee <laughs> or you pay a dollar or two and they're going to have free Wi-Fi. I bring my laptop, I put on my headset and I basically look at the clock and I say, okay, I've got one hour. One hour to kind of gr maintain and still grow the business. So if you have one hour, it's the same GWB system except instead of an hour each, you do 20 minutes each. So the first 20 minutes is going to be the growth strategy. Again, if you are doing social media, that could be writing a few posts. For me, it could be going out, so when I, if I'm on vacation, now that I'm doing YouTube, taking my phone and recording a five minute video, not a 10 or 15, a five minute video, uploading it to my computer, all I do is trim out the front and back. It's, it's through my, I don't know, quick time. I don't even use, I don't use any editing on this. So, I, I, so I've got five minute video, three minutes to edit, another five minutes to upload it to YouTube. So you're, you're basically about 20 minutes. If you run Facebook ads, maybe it's just creating one new ad 
or just looking at your numbers and tweaking one ad. Um, so whatever that thing is, that's the first 20 minutes, right? 20, 20 absolutely obsessively focused minutes on growth. The next 20 minutes is writing and that's where you make money and that's when you write your email to the list you've been building because you're growing it, you're getting people from your channels or your traffic to your list, right? So you're going from YouTube and you're going to ryanlee.com and you're signing up for my free newsletter. You know you are, because my newsletter's freaking good. So you're getting on the list and now I'm writing to you. And maybe I'm talking about the workshop I just did yesterday, all about email and you're on there and that's a $300 workshop or there's another pro or my new newsletter program and maybe you sign up for that or maybe you sign up for another workshop or maybe you sign up for a program I re-released or maybe you're clicking a link because I use Kajabi you're clicking a link to sign up for a free trial and when you become paid I'm going to get commission so I'm being monet monetization through that too you're finding out through this you're finding out about this through my email so first 20 minutes grow the second 20 minutes you knock out a quick email you're not Hemingway it doesn't have to be a Pulitzer Prize winning essay it's a short email here's what i'm doing here's what's going on here's my program i think you're gonna dig it if you want to get it go here and if not it's cool i'll see you tomorrow right and the final 20 minutes is the monetization which is often kind of planning ahead so okay i have a newsletter a a, a paid newsletter program maybe i start working on the next issue or I start working on a new promotion like you know what I think pulling out this section of YouTube of a small YouTube channel and creating a special report about that or turning that into a five dollar mini book or turning it into a, a, a front end ten dollar program to lead people into the newsletter so maybe I could start writing that or maybe I could start working on the sales page for that or maybe I could start building that thing out or maybe it's a new course that I'm working on I start outlining it but 20 minutes 20 minutes future like future money programs and products so the mistake people make is besides the beginning I talked about you know coming on and, and getting sucked into social media but the mistake people make is is obsessively focusing usually on one of the three it's often not the writing it's often not the email because people just don't email enough in them we'll talk about in the upcoming videos, but it's usually either the G, the growth, or the B, the bank. So they're either obsessively focusing on growth, 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 all I wanna do is grow, right? Everything's traffic, 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 and there's no monetization, so yeah, you have fans, but you have no money. <laughs> Which, yeah, look, if you just wanna have reach, cool, but if you wanna build a business, we've gotta actually, we've gotta got make money. You can't go to the bank and say, and they say, you know, your mortgage is due. Yeah, but you know what? I just got another thousand people on YouTube yesterday. <laughs> yeah, baby, not gonna work. Uh, the other thing people focus too much on is the monetization. All they do is create products and programs. I had one client, she came to me and she's like, Ryan, um, what do I do? I spent nine months building my membership site, nine months. And the thing just bombed. I launched it, no member, I didn't get anyone because all she did was spend time building it and she didn't actually spend time on any of the growth. So it, business has become lopsided. That's why if you only have one hour a day, 20 minute grow, 20 minute write, 20 minute bank, you put it together, it's a really good business. If you could do three hours, that's great, but if you're in a pinch, the one hour workday ain't bad. Like, subscribe, I'll see you in that. See, one of my kids is now getting in the car, going to work. And now that means it's time for me to go. I'll see you on the next video.